watching Let's Chat. This coming Sunday, spring officially arrives on the calendar, and that means baseball can't be far behind. Chattanooga Lookout's home opener coming up on April 12th. Dan Koff is here to talk about that. During the break, we were talking baseball. You think I didn't have time to get a baseball? Boy, were you wrong. You left that one. You left that one here from last year. Dan, good to see you. First of all, before we get into baseball, how's the little youngest member of the Cop family? She is awesome. Learning something new every day. Mm -hmm. How old? Five and a half months. Five and a half months. Yes. Wow. So your sleepless nights are continuing on a little bit more. Yeah, so don't really know what sleep is, so we're good. <laughs> <Not> anymore. <laughs> we're glad to see you. Um, home opener against Birmingham, August 12th. How is the team shaping up so far? Yes, April 12th. So we are under 30 days until opening day. Yeah. Uh, so now that the lockout is over, players have finally arrived at spring training in Arizona. Our guys have been there for a little bit, getting ready. So I think the team's going to look pretty good. This whole thing with Major League Baseball, I know, has impacted you guys, but not to the extent a lot of people have thought. But right. just to set the stage clear, all that crap with Major League Baseball is over. Yep, it's over, and we're ready to just play baseball. All right, now, tell us what we have to look forward to here at uh, Lookout Stadium coming up this year. You guys have got, I'm sure, the usual <laughs> array of promotional of course, nights. Of yes. What about used car night? Let's hop right into used it. Used car night presented by TVFCU is mm -hmm. back for every single Saturday. Wow, every single one? Every single one. And that's going to be a bunch. Um, what about fireworks? Oh, fireworks are back. How big? And Huge. Plus, this year we're going to have on July 1st, 2nd, and 3rd to celebrate Independence Day. Mm -hmm. We're going to have fireworks all over those nights. Wow. Yeah. Incredibly cool. They're super cool. What's the schedule looking like for the Lookouts this year? How do you feel about it so far? I feel good. I feel great. You know, especially in April and May, we've got a lot of games, and that's when it's going to be just a great time to come out to the ballpark. And of course, last year, I forgot how well the Lookouts finished, but it was way on up there, right? Yeah, especially towards the end, they really made a surge for, for the playoffs. So hopefully we can take that ending and, and kind of parlay into a good start. Maybe do, uh, you know, you win another three or four games on top of what you did last year. You're the exactly. champs, right? 100%. Um, what about working at the stadium? A lot of folks have wondered about that. Uh, that's been the talk here in the building. You have a lot of positions that are still open. Yes, we have a lot of positions still open. You know, if you want to work at food and beverage, we're looking for sweet cooks. So if you've ever been a cook in your life, come down, hang out at the stadium. What's a sweet cook? We're looking for someone to cook hamburgers and hot dogs oh, okay. and cook the food for our sweet level. And the and sweets. Yes, okay, now yes, I yes. got it. Now I got it. Uh, so hamburgers, hot dogs, any kind of fast food restaurant experience like yes. that would be a plus. Of course. What else are you looking for? Uh, we're looking for bat boys as well. Mm -hmm. So if you, ever, if you have a grandkid or a kid who's 16 years of age or older who loves baseball, send them our way. Any other qualifications we need to be aware of? No, just, just love, love the game and... You know, kind of just love baseball. And who doesn't? Yes, exactly. Uh, let's see. Give us a little bit more back to some of the yeah. promotions that you're going to have. Give us some of the ones that we may have forgotten about since last year or maybe something new you're going to try this year. Yes, so Thirsty Thursdays are back, and the rest of our promotional slate actually will be revealed on Wednesday. Uh, so stay tuned to Lookouts.com, and we'll have a whole bunch of new things to talk about. On these jobs that we're talking about, how yes. do you apply for them? Yes, go to Lookouts.com. You can fill out an online application. You can also give us a call at 423-267-2208, mm -hmm. or come on down and stop by. All right, and you can just stop by, pick up an application, yep. and you'll take it from there. Wow, this is going to be um, certainly an exciting season for the Lookouts. Again, Birmingham Barons coming up for the first home game April 12th, but you're playing away from town prior to that, right? Yes, yes. Uh, we're going to be playing April 8th against the Tennessee Smokies. Uh, against the Tennessee Smokies. Yes. He's just outside of Knoxville. That's a slam dunk. Look how it's a win, that <laughs> one. Um, one of these days, you're going to have to drag the big boss, Rich Mazingo, down. Yes. And we'll talk a little bit with, uh, uh, with Rich about what this upcoming season has to offer. And it looks like it's going to be jam-packed as always. It's going to be awesome. Dan, good to see you. You going home or you going to work? Going to work. Going to work. Then you go Got do your other do. job at yeah. home and take care of that little five-and-a-half-month-old. You'll have to bring her in. Let us put her on TV. Yes. We would love it. Find out more about how to get season tickets. They obviously are still yep. available. If you're interested in some of the jobs, check them out. Lookouts.com. That's lookouts.com. We'll be right back after this.